Hey guys, and welcome to another quick update video. Uh, interesting things have been going on, kind of, behind the scenes. Uh, I now have a desk now, uh, with my computer, and everything set up with a multi-monitor setup, um, and all that good shit, you know. Uh, I've actually wanted uh, my computer set up like this for, oh, I don't know, 10 years? Since before I actually started YouTube, in fact. And this is great. So, uh, my other half bought me a nice, really nice desk for Christmas, but she let me have it earlier. Um, we still haven't made any headway with the uh, internet, so we're still on like really shitty kind of um, scraping the bottom of the barrel speeds, but yeah, um, I can upload videos, it's fine. I can't stream, but uh, I can upload videos. So we're still fighting, we're still fighting to get faster speeds. In fact, uh, the way to go might actually be 4G, but that is going to involve um, a aerial antenna and a high-powered broadband, uh, 4G broadband router and all that kind of stuff, um, which I don't have now, but it's an avenue we can certainly explore in the future. Um, so anyway, yesterday, uh, came home from work, <clears throat> you know, as you do, and this desk came. So I spent all day setting it all up uh i borrowed the my partner's two monitors spent ages like literally ages uh setting it all up i've got my sexy ass um mechanical keyboard and my mouse and guys i've missed that so much it's so nice to have everything set up on a table and uh it was lovely only one major snag um, yeah, I set my PC up, it doesn't fucking work, mm -hmm. so I'm actually recording this on my laptop at the moment, which is some 7th gen uh, i3 laptop, so... You know, it's got all of the processing power of a of a dying gazelle. Oh, hello. And I've got a lovely mug of coffee. Thank you. Thank you. Um, yeah, so my laptop's got all the, the power of a dying gazelle. So not a huge amount I can I can really do with that at the moment. Now my PC um, okay, so it wasn't in the best of health when I moved. Uh, I knew that. Um, because just, uh, I think it was when I finished streaming a few, quite a few months ago now, because fuck my ass and call me Charlie. It's been a ooh, four months, I think, since I've last done my stream. But those of you who used to join me will probably remember, I think I, I mentioned it on the, the stream following that, none of those will be archived by now, I guess, because I've been here and I haven't been able to archive old streams. Um, my cat threw up in my computer, and... Well, ladies and gentlemen, let's just say that was... A trying time, uh, I think it's fair to say. I had 16 gigs of RAM in my computer. One of those RAM sticks was absolutely fucked and uh, I couldn't recover it. Uh, but one worked, you know, eight gigs. So whatever. I mean, my computer, guys, is like six years old. So you expect these things, you know. Um... But now, when I, uh, since it's been sitting here for about two months uh, unused, I fired it up uh, yesterday and it boot loops. No, <laughs> boot looping is, is 
can be quite easy to fix. Sorry, it power cycles. So it will turn itself on, then off, then on, then off, then on, then off, then on, then off, then on, then off. And the only way to stop the cycle is to switch it off at the um, the power supply, the, the main switch. So, yeah, bit of a kick in the bollocks, but uh, it's fine. I'm going to have to do some testing. I'm pretty sure, I mean, usually when this sort of thing happens, it's either the power supply or a short somewhere, but I have disconnected all the cables, thoroughly cleaned it all, connected everything back up, and it still does it. Uh, hey guys, guess what? I've got my new nice um, setup and everything, or a workstation, shall we say, and I'm still too stupid to remember to mute my phone. Well, I guess some things never change. So that's where we're at right now. Um, yeah, after all this time, I, I've finally got a nice workspace. Uh, really nice desk as well. Um, I would love to show you photos of this. Uh, I did actually post a photo of it up uh, yesterday on Instagram. But... <sighs> Without my main PC and all that lot at the moment, and <laughs> now I've had to kind of take half of it apart and <laughs> like jerry rig my laptop up uh, in place of one of the monitors. And oh god, you know, it's kind of been an interesting move. I feel like I feel like in a lot of ways we've made two steps forwards and about six hundred back. Uh, but for my own mental state, I need to. I need to believe we are moving in the right direction. Uh, I think we are. I just, I didn't realize how disruptive this move was going to be. And my God, guys, I cannot even tell you how much I miss the channel. I miss the interactions. I miss the Let's Play, man. And the worst thing is we've got Let's Plays that are like, <laughs> they're wrong, they're we're like halfway through them. Oh, it's such a ball ache. Um, but yeah, uh, unfortunately, the, the, at this moment, and this close to Christmas, I mean, it's Sunday today. I don't know how long this video is going to take to upload 7,000 years. Uh, I don't know. Uh, and on that note, we might actually, when we finally get back to recording videos, I don't know how I'm going to upload them. Mm. But we'll, we'll <laughs> you know what? That that bridge is so far down the line right now. I, I'm, it, whatever, whatever. We'll, we'll, we'll figure that out. Uh, even if I have to upload them to my phone and uh, take a walk into town, which is um, 30 seconds from my house. Uh, to upload them on my phone because my 4G connection in town is phenomenal. Uh, which, yeah, I mean, it's a little bit sucky, but, you know, it, it, at this point in time, it is what it is. You know, if that's what I've got to do to upload videos, that's what I've got to do. That's that's just the way it is. Um, that's not the end of the world. The end of the world is uh, not being able to stream. And look, I again, I was like, you know, I'll just quickly have a quick video of me talking a load of old bollocks into my microphone because I've missed it. And I've, I've, you know, I've, I feel like I barely said anything. We're on 10 minutes. Uh, so PC fix. Not really sure. I'm going to take it apart when I get some more time. But obviously, that's quite difficult at the moment because we're on the run up to Christmas. And we don't get any time off for Christmas. So... Yeah, um, if it's a power supply, if it's something simple like that, I mean, I've got a friend that's offered to, to lend me one to test, <laughs> but uh, I mean, it's a very nice offer. Um, you can't say it's not, but I'm a bit apprehensive with that because I don't want to take, I don't want to bring the power supply in here and then fry it. Because then, um, 
Well, at least if I fry his power supply, I, I, I know it's uh, something in my PC that's screwed, probably the motherboard or a wire. But then that means I've got to replace his power supply first before I um, worry about fixing mine. But also at this point, to be honest, guys, like I'm in a new place. I've got a new setup. I've got everything's all new and lovely. I keep thinking, you know, why not just... Why not just start start again? Just uh, build a new computer. And then I'm like, oh, right, yes. <laughs> it, because that's expensive. Um, yeah, the reality of that hits home. Um, I mean, it needs to be done. And unfortunately, diagnosing my computer and finding out exactly what's wrong with it and why it's not booting, I don't really have the tools to do that here. I don't have, you know... 1080 Ti's laying around spare. Um, I don't have a, a drawer full of hard drives to test. Um, so yeah, we, we're kind of, kind of at that stage at the moment. Um, but we are moving forwards. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to stay positive with me. I'm, I'm doing my best to stay positive. Um, oh, literally just to record a video um <laughs> well i mean yeah this is cool but just to record some games again oh that's been my life for so long it it i've been playing a lot of my playstation uh 4 uh in fact i completed titanfall 2 um a couple of days ago because uh i got all this time after work now and i don't record anymore uh, i i don't yeah i don't record anymore so i've been playing games but i find it so unfulfilling playing games on my own like not recording it like i mean because with Titanfall 2 <laughs> so much like random funny shit happened and i'm just like oh man that would have been funny in a video or oh i could have you know uh come up with some witty banter about that i say witty banter you know um on the down low we know <clears throat> we know it'd probably be a cringe fest but what i'm trying to say is we're, we're getting for we're moving forwards i think um it it's been very painful um and yeah to be serious for a minute it, it does feel like i'm taking one step forwards and 20 back but these things are temporary, you know? I'm not going to give up because I love the channel. I love interacting with you guys. And uh, also, I can't believe how many people are, like, sticking by. Like, I keep expecting my subscription numbers to start dropping back, but they're not. They're actually going up, which is really cool to see. But uh, just, I, I want to, I don't know, want to upload some more content for you guys but um the best i can do at the moment is this video um just explaining to you uh lovely human beings where we are right now so yeah well if i don't update you guys um in the next couple of days i hope you all have a fantastic christmas or whatever kind of holiday you celebrate um and thanks for sticking with me it's really appreciated because as soon as I moved in here and I noticed that we had no internet, I shit myself. I was like, that's it. It's all gone. And the more time that I spent with uh, OpenReach and all that lot and BT and they just basically tell you you're shit out of luck and basically, oh yeah, you're stuck on copper. Um, I know you'd like fiber, but go fuck yourself. You're not worthy, essentially. Which, yeah, cheers, guys. God, I wish OpenReach didn't have the monopoly. Unfortunately, in, in Cornwall, OpenReach is the company that builds the digital network um, and telecom uh, network. There are other companies as well, like Virgin and um, Hyperoptic and uh, a few other Cybrus network um, that are slowly joining the fray. But unfortunately, OpenReach has has such a tight grip on the UK's infrastructure that there is no other option for us down here. You know, you can choose different ISPs, but the company that builds the network, um, there's only one. 
So it is what it is. But there are other options. I, I have written to my member of parliament, the governor of Truro and Falmouth. I sent her a very long uh, email with photos of my box and uh, photos of my box. Hmm. They can be taken in a, in a few different ways. Let's not think about each other's boxes right now. Let's think about the internet. Yes, the pure, pure internet that we don't have. Hmm. So I sent her a load of photos and um, I'm hoping that she's going to eventually get back to me. I'm not holding my breath. Uh, the only other option we have is something called a community partnership, which is where you have to go around to all of your neighbours, drum up support, and Open Reach pays for X amount of the um, line upgrades. And I think the government pays for some of it, the local council pays for some of it, and then you pay for whatever's left. Uh, which for what I can understand, for us, would not be a lot. But I know upgrading some of those cabinets has cost a quarter of a million pounds. So, <laughs> I mean, you know, not a lot of a quarter of a million could be something stupid like, you know, a good few thousand. But anyway, we're going to see uh, see what happens. I'm going to go now before this is a 20-minute video, which it nearly is. And uh, I sit here worrying all day about how I'm going to upload it. So anyway guys, thank you very much for listening. And as always, till next time.